today I'm going to do a classic salad. The thing that makes this salad is the dressing. And what salad is it, you ask? It's the Caesar salad. I've got a bit of chicken left over, so I'm going to turn that into a wonderful salad. Now, to make the dressing, you need a few ingredients. Firstly, we've got some anchovies, the much maligned anchovies. I personally think it's one of the best condiments in the whole entire world. And uh, when I worked at the River Cafe, me and Rose used to have anchovies on toast for breakfast. I'd come in, we'd turn the grill on, I'd do some bruschetta, rub it with garlic, anchovies, I'd put a few over the toast, a bit of marjoram, and give Rose a plate. And uh, that was her breakfast. So in we go, some anchovies. We need Dijon mustard, a good tablespoon of Dijon mustard, a clove of garlic, in we go. I'm using the back end of a fork because I don't have a spoon. And here we're just going to squeeze in some lemon juice, the juice of one lemon, like so. Just catch the seeds in your hand and that's it. Lots of acidity because this recipe can be quite rich, or this dressing. So we've got our anchovies, our garlic, our mustard, our lemon juice, now some eggs. These are eggs that I call coddled eggs. So basically I've boiled them for three minutes and the yolk is still lovely and yolky, but the white is firm. And we're just gonna break those into our dressing. And I just, I'm just doing this because I like seeing the yolk go everywhere. But look at those lovely eggs. They're the, uh, the happy eggs, 30 chickens to a hectare. Absolutely beautiful. You can tell that they're free range by the color of the yolks. And now uh, we're just gonna break that up. So we've got chunks of egg white. We've got the richness of the egg yolks and all the wonderful seasonings, the garlic, the anchovies, the mustard, the lemon juice. We're just gonna whisk in. I'll just break it up a little bit with our whisk. And then I'm gonna whisk in like you would make a mayonnaise, some extra virgin olive oil, and it's gonna become lovely and thick. But we're not making a mayonnaise, we're just making a dressing. I hate Caesar salads that are made with thick, horrible mayonnaise. Even though they've got anchovies and all the garlic and parmesan and whatever have you, it's just not the same. It should be made like this. Okay, so all of our olive oil into there like that. I'm just gonna taste it again. It needs a bit of salt. It needs a bit of pepper. We're gonna put some parsley in there. Put some chopped parsley. So the dressing's made. Now, just here, I've got some additional things. Of course, I've got my croutons. I've got more parmesan. And here, Caesar salad would not be a Caesar salad without our pancetta. I'm just going to cut this, just take the, the rind off it. Cut it into large strips. This is possibly one of the most famous salads in the world, the Caesar salad. Someone came to the restaurant of this chef and uh, he was asked to whip something up and he used what he had at hand to make this salad. So we've just cut our pancetta, which has been fried. Not super crispy, but crispy enough. So we've got our dressing, our pancetta, some croutons that we've just tossed in some clarified butter, a bit of garlic through the oven, toasted up nicely so they're crunchy. Now, I need some lettuce. Hey, Johnny boy. Hey, hey. You, yeah, yeah, you got any lettuce for me, mate? Uh, yeah, what? Normal lettuce or cost lettuce? I little little baby gem, yeah, well, baby yeah. gem. Oh, beautiful. Just two, that's enough. Eight. Two, I think, would be fine. Two. Okay, one, two. Sensational. Look at those little babies. Lovely and fresh. It's great when you've got a wonderful, handsome fruiterer like that's John. Eight. That's you. That's I said handsome that's fruiterer. Beautiful. <laughs> a face only a mother could love. <laughs> oh, hilarious. So now, how am I going to cut these? I might just cut them lovely and chunky like so. Okay, and I'm going to put them in the bowl, break them up. So you want 
all parts of the lettuce. You want the, the, the top sort of softer leaf, but this bottom part, which is really sort of nice and firm, is great and chunky and crunchy. So, in we go. And lettuce is always best served cold. I would advise you actually to wash your lettuce and put it in the fridge cupboard so it gets lovely and crispy. And there's nothing more refreshing than the crunch of a really cold, crisp lettuce. I'm just going to finish this dressing off now with some parmesan cheese. Good little pinch, a little bit of seasoning. I really need a spoon. Well, I've just got John, my gopher, getting me a spoon. Here he comes. Oh, that one. That'll do. Beautiful. <laughs> That's just what I needed. Now, this is the chicken that I had previously. I'm just going to arrange this through the salad and I've shredded it all up nice and chunky. Now, it's important with salads that you have some texture. You have some depth to it. Just don't all pack it in. It's got to be light so all the flavours get through. Okay, that's enough chicken. Now, for our dressing. You need to be quite liberal with the dressing. Nothing worse than a dry salad. Not the proper ones. Not, oh. not the game of the ones. <laughs> Too late, mate. <laughs> oh, come the, on. The, the, the train has left the oh. station. Okay. And we'll use all of that up, just sitting on the top. And it's going to find its way down to the bottom because we've given it enough space. Then we're going to get our pancetta and we'll just scatter that all over it like so. Stick it in the little holes. Yum. That's a big hole. We've got a little bit more chopped parsley here. And then we hit it with our croutons, which is crunch. More crunch. We're just going to take from the Parmesan Reggiano some nice little shavings of Parmesan. And I like to do it from a height so half of it hits the table. Now, so it just flutters down. And there we have my wonderful leftover roast chicken Caesar salad. Fresh, crunchy, and completely yummy. Yo, Johnny! <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's dinner time. Okay. You, know, you know what? Time. Okay. You tell me. Yum. Smells good. Okay, here we go. Got a bit of everything. Yeah, right? yum. I guess a bit of that. A bit of anchovies. Mmm. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> but you'd, I could put anything in that, and you would have gone. No, 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 no. A little bit more anchovy would be perfect. For oh, me. really? No, yeah. oh, see, see. Like yeah, I know. I love a anchovy as well. Here, I've got some okay, more. Have a but, uh, <laughs> Now we're talking. Now, you, now you've got to eat that bit. Yum. Yeah, I love anchovies. Yum. Mmm. Buonissima. That is beautiful. It's the coals that make yum. it. Those lettuces oh. are like so crunchy and fresh. Look at that. Mmm. Oh, yum. <laughs>